Hey everybody, Jason here uh, for RPG A Day 2018, question number seven, and that is, uh, how can a GM make the stakes more important? I think there's a few ways a GM can do that. Um, I think a few ways would be one to find out what is important both to the characters that the PCs are playing and also what are things are important to the players and kind of sort of intertwine those some of those things together so you don't want to push any personal buttons with a player and get too deep unless that's something that your group is comfortable with but if you can touch on subjects that you know are important to your players a lot of times we channel ourselves through our play, our, our characters so I think that we may not know it, but sometimes our characters have things that are important to them because they're important to us as players, even though it's not something we necessarily thought of as being important to the character. Um, so I think intertwining some of those things can be good. That can help. Um, I think part of it also, a big part of it also, is the tone that the GM sets for the players in the game. You know, if you're running a game where you're letting the players do whatever they want and be crazy at the table and you're just laughing every five minutes and uh, it's just chaos and, and funny stuff and being goofy. Not that that can't, some things can't be taken seriously because I, I, they always could be, but I think if the tone of the game is more serious that that can help reel the players in and, you know, keep things going at a more... I don't want to say emotional level, but when things are at stake, I guess that can be more emotional, I suppose. But I think having the the, the tone set in the proper manner, um, and I think maybe that could be helped uh, with a session zero. Uh, I know a lot of groups don't do session zeros. In fact, most of the time, we don't do session zeros. We just kind of talk about this, our, our campaigns before they start a little bit, but don't have a full-on session zero. But I think tone is a big part of it. And I know this isn't part of the uh, the wording in the question. How can the GM set you know m make the stakes important? I, but I think a lot of it also is player buy-in, also, which kind of goes back to the last the last question of how do the players make the world seem real? A, a lot of it, I think, is player buy-in. If you have players who don't care, they're just there to be there, or they just want to roll dice and kill stuff or they're there just to get out of the house and hang out with their friends and don't really care about the game, it doesn't matter what the GM does if the players don't really give a shit. I, I you know, the the players have to buy in also. It's gotta be it's a two way street. You know, it takes more than just the GM. However, the players could also be taking everything completely serious and the GM might not be taking it serious, therefore can't make the stakes important. Or he may just not be very experienced or may not be the most talented GM. So he may try, but, you know, if the players can help him along, you know, it's kind of a, you know, it's that circle relationship. You know, players help the GM, the GM helps the players. But I think, you know, those few things, the, the tone and then finding things that are personal to both the, the players and the characters... Um, can both help uh, make the stakes important, and you know, taking the game seriously, taking things ser everything seriously, can can really help. So that is my uh, answer for RPG a Day 2018, question number seven. So hope everyone's out having a good day and uh, gets involved in RPG a Day 2018, and have fun. See ya.